Welcome to my project ideas. This is an ongoing series on chat GPT projects. In this particular project, we'll create a simple portfolio website using chat GPT. So the plan is like we'll just use chat GPT and we'll ask questions from chat GPT regarding the steps to create a website and also we'll use an IDE. So preferably I prefer notepad plus plus, but you can use anything. So we'll directly jump to chat GPT portal. So here I am, I will ask uh, how to create a portfolio website using HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Let's see what answer it gives. So now it is going to uh, create some steps for us, the structure of the website. So what it says that uh, plan the layout and structure of the website, this include designing deciding on the number of pages so it is not giving me any you know exact code i need code to create a html code folio website so now i will get a code and uh, we'll see what all it uh, gives us certainly i can see that uh, uh, based on the uh, generic layout on the internet it has created a layout in html where it has uh, you know about a section contact section project section and a simple footer is also there that, that's great that's great so we'll just uh, copy this uh, entire layout great so it has also mentioned that this website is not dynamic this is not including a css that's why it's uh, it will not look beautiful so we'll just uh, check out we'll just copy the code so you can open up notepad plus plus or if you have no nothing else you can open notepad just paste the code we'll save this entire thing somewhere on the desktop so i will go to desktop i'll create a new folder for chat gpt um, app something like that and inside it will create something called index.html all the HTML files should be saved in this format all files index.html click on save minimize the screen we'll just uh, refresh to see our folder here yeah here it is double click on that okay so it has created a layout it has something called projects which looks like this contact section this look like this but it's not beautiful right uh, add css to above code to make it beautiful let's see what it replies So you see every time you ask something and then you ask the next question you are you, you can refer your old question and with reference to the answer that it has provided earlier it will add new sections of answers and you can reuse those answers to uh, modify your uh, end output So let it complete then uh, I will quickly explain what exactly it is doing.
Mm. Great, great. It's uh, it's also adding uh, media queries. You know, making it responsive for mobile phones. Awesome. So, if you can see within the header section, head option is the right. If I go back to the code that we have written, we have head, and the head all was only having this title section, but now it is having something else. So I'll just copy and replace the entire head with this. That's it. I've saved the entire code. I'll go to the website and click refresh. You see, the same content is now refreshed, and it looks awesome. It also made it uh, you know responsive to mobile phones. So if I uh, just change the layout to mobile phones like this. Okay, so we'll separate this out. You see, it is uh, responsive to mobile phones also, and for that, it has it also written the code. So we'll just switch to the code. So what it does, like uh, for every elements that it has created in HTML, for those elements, it has added the values like this. So now we have created code for HTML. We have created code for CSS. So let's uh, look on the website and see what we can, you know, create in terms of uh, JavaScript. So if I say this, okay. So this is something called Project One. So create a JavaScript code. Here. Wrong spelling or what is correct? Code for the above program uh, where it redirects project one to. I will give uh, something, you know. So if I go and get this link, fine. So I want the project one to be hyperlinked to some something else. You know, as of now it does not navigate to anywhere, and I will use JavaScript for that. But I do not know the coding, right? So that in that case, I am asking Chat GPT to to do something for me. And it is even explaining what exactly this piece of code is doing. So this is a, an awesome tool, you know, because uh, people you will get a lot of code and a lot of ideas on the internet, but uh, those ideas uh, does not explain what is the concept behind the whole programming sections. But it has given the comments and even explained the exact uh, pieces of codes. So we just copy the code again. I need to paste it somewhere, right? So I can paste it in head or in the body. So let's do, let's add in the body itself. Body starts from here. I will just paste the script. That's it. I will go to the code, refresh it. So now, if you can see in the bottom, it uh, is pointing to some other website. When I clicked it, it has taken me to this website. That, that's an awesome uh, event that we have just created. So we have created a website using HTML. We have added CSS on top of that. And then we have written JavaScript to perform some actions. So this is a small portfolio project that I did entirely with the help of chat GPT. I was having some basic ideas of HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. So that was helpful in placing the code, but uh, I have not written a single line of code. I've just copied and pasted. So I hope you found this uh, website creation useful and you can create uh, beautiful websites using ChatGPT. Thank you. We'll see you in another video. Bye bye.